But the infrastructure of the festival offers so much opportunity for people to gain skills and to be exposed to so much and learn and grow by working the festival. And you do that beautifully with your mentoring um, young staff. So where are some of them now? <laughs> who, who have you well, passed through a former days? assistant of mine, Amanda, is now one of the most sought after, very, very successful uh, producer and advice media. She travels the world. Oh, wow. And um, yeah, she makes about, I would say, 10 times as much as I make. Oh, my <laughs> God. Uh, <laughs> fine. She can take me out to dinner. Um, you know, I mean, we have so many of them either work, I mean, a lot of them work in film. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, some of them, we have, when you met Alana, we, we, we went to an event at Jen and I went to a music event in the area, and all of a sudden the person behind the counter who was the producer of the event was this person, Alana Davis, who started as an intern at the festival, then we hired her to work with the staffer. And then she went around the country working for other film festivals, and one of her last gigs was to produce the whole um, virtual reality arcade at Tribeca, which is huge. I mean, wow. probably cost about a million dollars. Huge stuff. Uh, and now, and she travels the, the country producing huge yeah, events. Yeah. So she's a major event producer now. Yeah. And um, she produced the 23 Arts Music Festival. I think this was its first or second year. It's fantastic.